Okay, so class, art na marusubong sa ato nga Earth and Life Science, Quarter 1, Module 4, Earth Indogenic Processes. Credits kali sa nag-drawing sa ato nga pictures, subong. Okay, so ang ato illustrator si Ma'am Sherlyn Pabiliario kay si Sir Orencio Estrera. So for this module, which is the Indogenic Processes, uh, this module was designed and written with you in mind. It is here to help you describe where the Earth's internal heat comes from, describe how magma is formed, and explain how the movement of plates lead to the information of folds and folds. So the scope of this module allows you to use it in many different learning situations. The language used recognizes the diverse vocabulary level of students. The lessons are arranged to follow the standard sequence of the course, but the order in which you read them can be changed to correspond with the textbook you are using now. So anyway, this module is divided or compressed into three lessons. Lesson one, sources of the Earth's internal heat. Lesson two, magmatism. And lesson three, folding and folding. So after going through this module, you are expected to Describe where the Earth's internal heat comes from. Describe how magma is formed. Describe what happens after magma is formed. Discuss how folds and faults are formed. Perform an experiment showing the mechanisms of heat transfer. Perform an experiment showing factors responsible for the different types of eruptions in a volcano. And perform an experiment showing the formation of fold and fault. And then cite the application of the Earth's endogenic processes. So what you will do is simply answer all in capital letters. I will check on this. So we have 10 questions. After that, go over with lesson one, sources of Earth's internal heat. Okay, so Monisha, you will have the layers of the Earth. Simply read na lang. And then you will try to do the I will do this. Activity one, chocolate mantle convection. So you will be given an illustration of how heat flows from the inner earth and read the section below. So you will read the uh, selection below and then the materials that you will do is, or you will need is a glass of water, chocolate powder, any wooden stick for stirring, empty cup, can, a rug, and a candle. So what you will do is you will do the following. So procedure, put water in the empty can, Sprinkle it with the chocolate powder until the top is thickly covered with dry powder. So, pwede ka mo ka baka sa any convenience store if may ara. Okay? So, if may chocolate drink ka mo daw or chocolate powder yung nausar, no branding of names, pwede ka mo, ma, uh, you can also use that. To slowly place it on the pan holder, light the candle and place it under the center of the can. Let it boil for a few minutes and observe what happens. So for analysis questions, how is street heat transferred based on the activity? So check on the applicable box. So check mo lang. Is it advection, irritation, convection, conduction? For number two, how will you describe advection? So uh, click one box lang de. For conduction, also click one box. And convection, only select one box. Next, so I learned this. Fill in the blank, select your answers from the word box. So, Ari, uh, can you select lang ang answers sa harin sa word box nga rata? For geologic, primordial heat, radioactive heat, conduction. Then, so I practice this. Below is an illustration of Earth showing the different layers of the Earth. Label the layers of the Earth in numbers 1 to 3 and heat transfer mechanisms in number 4, five, four to 6. So, kung makita na day, layers of the Earth, so, Ari, ang Ari, di ni siya nga part, ano ni siyang tawag. Ang Ari, ano ni siyang part, ang Ari, ano ni siyang part. So, layers of the earth ni. And then, sa heat of, uh, heat transfer mechanisms, um, Ari, 5 to 6. So, ano ni siya? Ang number 4, sa number 4, Ari, ang, ang arrow amo ni. Ang sa number 5, ang amo ni nga arrow. Ang sa number 6, ang amo ni nga arrow. Okay? So, Next, I apply this. Identify the pictures that show the different processes caused by the external and internal sources of energy. Write A if it is done. Uh, is it due to external sources and B for internal sources? So the following are the descriptions. So among mga pictures ta. 
answers right A or B lang. So we have five questions. And then nasa under sa I test myself, multiple choice again, read each item carefully, select the letter of the best answer, all in capital letters. One to five questions na. Then you will go to lesson two. So sa lesson two, it's all about magmatism. So we, you will have the lesson overview. Okay. And then just go over lang da. And then sa, I will do this na part. Um, activity 2 is the magnificent magmatism. So what you will do is you will have the following materials. Two and open. So the cans. Any brand and size will do. And then a timer. For procedure, label the soda cans as A and B. Then shake the soda can A for 10 seconds. Then open soda uh, open the soda can and observe how soda move out of the can. Um, sa procedure, dapat number 4, 5, tag 6 na day. So, I don't know what happened. So, anyway, get the soda can labeled as B naman this time. Gay na A to, then subong B. Shake the soda can B for 20 to 30 seconds and open it. Kung can A, gin shake mo sa for 10 seconds. So, the B is 20 to 30 seconds. And then observe how the soda move out of the can. Then you answer the analysis questions. Compare the eruption of uh, soda in the two cans. Which can, uh, which can had a more violent reaction? So you write either A or B. Okay. Number two, what happened when you shake the soda cans for a longer period of time? So check one box only. For number three, relate the amount of dissolved gas in magma to the type of volcanic eruption. So choose only one. So check mo lang. And your case, since wala ka mo so answer sheet, all you have to do is just write the answers na pili nyo. Okay? So next, I learned this. Fill in the blanks. Select your answer from the word box. So ang word box tag contains some words nga protonism, volcanism, magmatism, magma, and uplifting. So, if you check class, ang kalandering answers are nang ito na sa module niyo. All you, all you need to do is just to simply read. Amulang gina. I practice this. You make a brochure about magmatism. Include the following details. Your name and section and front page. Description of magmatism. Plotonism, volcanism, importance of magma. Inside the sources on the last page. So use long band paper, kindly take note of the rubrics below. So my rubric tadi class, uh, design and layout, spelling and grammar, completeness, and then graphic, clip art, word art, content. So that's a total of 50%. So so I apply this, um, enumerate below are the enumerated below are the importance of magmatism. Write true if the statement is correct, otherwise false if it is incorrect. So identify lang if true or false. Then again, answer I test myself. That is five questions. Next, lesson three, folding and faulting. Again, all you have to do is simply read. May aral dyan nakabutang ng mga simulations. Are you? You can click this site or go to this site and it will give you a simulation of fold and movement of tectonic plates. Nabutang na dira. And then simply read the different uh, three types of folds. So, ara man na siya. So, simply read lang. And then, three types of folds. So, kindly read along as well. And then, may ara man ta, ano ang iya ng economic significance. So, so, I will do this na part under activity three. Help, there is a fold. Fold, there is a fold. So, the materials that you will use is 200 grams flour, water, recycled thick paper, cup, bowl, and scissors. Sa procedure, make sure to download the experiment or make sure to do the experiment outside the house. Measure one cup of flour and put it in a bowl. Add the add one cup of water. Uh, sorry, add the one cup of water, which is uh, in flour, and mix it using a spoon. Sorry, do na salat ko Anyway, you may add water little by little until you see a consistent mixture that is not too dry or too wet. Get a recycled thick paper which can serve as the tectonic plates uh, for your base. I don't know what happened, but may mga kulang a letter. So anyway, uh, cut it into half to make the tectonic plates. Put one side over the other. 
pour on the floor mixture on top of the paper. So, aring mo on mo. Sa sa letter A, pour A nga consider slide one paper to the right or left. Observe what happens sa the floor mixture on top. So, for B, try to push the apparent push the paper toward each other. Observe what happens to the flour mixture in the middle. For step five, get another thick paper and put the flour on top of it. Try to push the ends of the paper towards the center and then observe what happens. So you may also click on the video found online for your reference. Simply click it. So say it's already found in YouTube. So the analysis questions, uh, for number one, what is formed in step 4A? Then what is formed in step 4B and what is formed in step 5? So, Arasha. So, simply write your answers lang. And then I learned this. Fill in the blanks, select your answer from the word box. So, ang word box, tanga word is fold Himalayan Mountains, San Andreas, fold the endogenic processes. So, I practice this, make a Venn diagram comparing and contrasting the two crustal deformation processes. The choices are given in the box below. So, Ari, pili lang ka mo di kaya para hapos sa inyo. Diri yung sa under sa fold, makita mo di, dili sa ilang, makita mo nga processes that is the result of folding. Sa diri, fold naman, amuman. Ang both naman, butang mo di kung ano makita mo nga applicable for both of them. Sa part 2, make a graphic organizer showing the summary of the concepts being discussed in that lesson. So, ang Ari, crustal deformation, ang bend, what is it? May three types. Ang crack or split, ano na siya, and then may mata three types. Again, so I apply this true or false, Japan. So you have there, uh, modified true or false. Write true if the statement is correct, or change the underlined word if it is incorrect. So amura na siya. Then answer, I test myself, all in capital letters. So we have five questions. So if you have questions so far, simply message me sa aton nga group chat. Okay, so thank you. Just don't forget to always read. Ah, ang answers. So thank you.